Java is required to install EPN JPOS 4. Java is integral to the internet applications and other e-business solutions that are the foundation of corporate computing. Our EPN JPOS install will load Java if needed. Log into your eProcessing Network account at www.eprocessingnetwork.com. At the top right, select Login and then Merchant Login. Now, enter in your username account number. The username will always be numeric. Press the Tab key, then enter in the password and click Login. From the blue menu bar to the left, select Software Apps, then click EPN JPOS. Click the EPN JPOS download. Scroll down and click the EPN JPOS for download. Depending on your system configuration, your PC will either auto save this file in the downloads folder or prompt you to save as. Go ahead and save it to the downloads folder. Open the downloads folder, locate the EPN JPOS setup file, and right click. Then click on Run as Administrator. Your user account control setting will ask to allow the access of this application. Continue the installation and follow the prompts. Double-click the EPN JPOS 4 icon on your desktop. You will be prompted to activate EPN JPOS Initial Activation or Clerk Activation. Select Initial Activation for new installs only. Enter your eProcessing Network account username and password. It's the same as your website login. Then click the Continue button. Enter your company's account information company name, address, and your contact information. This will be your receipt header information. Then click Continue. Next, select your preferences, tip, convenience fee, allow emails, and then click Continue. Create a new clerk or edit an existing one. Create the login and password. The password is not mandatory. Enable clerk permissions. So go ahead and check the box for sales and voids and then click continue. Click continue. Create a new terminal. This can be the PC station name or location or highlight an existing terminal. Name the terminal, enable, and accept credit, and click Continue. Click Configure your terminal. Enter in the manager login and password. Click Continue. Click Equipment and select Swiper or Terminal. Click Printing and select Printer from the drop-down menu. Set the number of receipts and save changes if it's a desktop printer. On the receipt printer, select your layout and add width of the paper in inches. As far as receipt options go, set to 15 PR. And save changes. And that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching.